Hello YouTube, JR sir, and today's project is an amazing project which is transmitting electricity without wire or we can say wirelessly. So I know the video is long, it's nine minutes approximately, but it's fully detailed and it's step by step, even the soldering. So stay tuned and let's start. <laughs> The components are 1.5 volt battery holder, some wires, MPN transistor, and the code is written under it. Also, 1k ohm resistor, some LEDs. 1.5 volt battery or you can say AA battery Kappa insulated wire and that's it so this is the circuit diagram of our project this is the transmitter part or you can say the primary coil and this is the secondary coil or you can say the receiver they are pretty simple and you can download both of them Link down in the description, make sure to check it out. I'll start by making the secondary coil or you can say the receiver and I'll start by making the coil which is 30 turns and try to find the circular object or round object. Try to wind a couple wire around it 30 turns to form a coil and let's start. Cut it after you finish the turns and remove from the round object. Yeah, like this. And try to use another couple wire to screw the coil from unwinding. Like this. So now our coil is finished, as you can see it, so the secondary coil is finished. After finishing the coil, all you have to do is add an LED to it, like the circuit diagram, and simply solder it to it, solder the LED to the coil. As you can see it, I soldered the LED to the Cool. and now our receiver circuit is finished now it's time to make the primary coil or we can say the transmitter circuit and we'll start by making the three pin coil and let's start wind the couple wire around the round object for 15 turns after 15 turns make something like this and it will be your third pin and continue back until another 15 turns and after finishing it try to cut it and remove the curl from the round object slowly and carefully and wind the couple wire around the coil to screw from unwinding like this and now you've got three pins as you can see it one two three and this is the three pin coil so after printing the three pin coil I will add three different color wires to it to make things easier. So as you can see, I added three wires to it, to the coil. Now I'll start making the transmitter circuit or we can say the primary coil and I will add the 1k resistor to the base of the transistor or you can say the middle pin and let's do it 
as you can see it. After that I will connect the left pin of the transistor to the negative side of the battery. Like this. Next I will uh, connect the middle pin of the coil to the positive side of the battery. So on the coil it is the green wire. I'll connect it to the positive side of the battery like this. Now as you can see the positive side of the battery is connected to the middle pin of the coil. Then I'll connect the right side of the coil uh, which is white to the 1k resistor. Just like this. And finally, I will add the left side of the coil to the right side of the transistor. And the color of the wire is yellow. Just like this. So now it's time to test it and let's see the results. Simply insert the battery like this oh, sorry and let's test it as you can see it works perfectly yeah as you can see it so this is the final test and I put everything inside this small box and the coil the transistor is in here as you can see the resistor also the battery let's close it and test with a blue LED as you can see it's very very bright and the distance is amazing and the white one yeah it's the same and that's it uh, as you can see it it's very powerful